throwing on first down. Hines letting one go deep for the end zone. And that is incomplete. 16 seconds now on the clock. The Pro Bowl wideout, Devontae Adams, his intended receiver. And that'll bring up second down. And applause in the action because the booth, they see something that they want to take another peek at to find out if this was a touchdown or not. a touchdown and they have decided it will not be a touchdown six points off the board from the 21 it's second and 10 throwing again Hines and he'll look for Adams again and this time he's got him and he'll go down here at the 12 yard line they had the catch on second down, but it didn't help at all. And now they're looking at third down here. Well, Charles, they were close in the end, but they couldn't get that last play, that last little miracle play done. They were within striking distance, but couldn't find a way to score. They definitely had hope. They definitely had opportunity. Just unable to cash in at the end. Not an easy play by any stretch, but they definitely had a chance. So for Houston, the win moves him up to 5-2 and two now on the year. And they'll be able to enjoy this one through the bye week before they get back at it again. Meanwhile, for the Packers, they can't quite seem to turn things around as they fall into 2-4 and four now on the year. And they'll get a home date next week against the Minnesota Vikings. I'm Brandon Gordon. Certainly have to thank Charles Davis, my broadcast partner, and our entire crew. We'll catch you next time right here. It's the NFL on EA Sports.